if I don't forgive him, then God won't let me make it to heaven. So I forgive him. <laughs> Former Beaufort attorney Corey Fleming is headed to federal prison after pleading guilty to conspiracy to commit wire fraud. Prosecutors say Fleming conspired with Alec Murdoch to steal money from clients. A judge sentenced Fleming to three years and 10 months for his role. Investigative reporter Ann Emerson is live at the federal courthouse downtown. So, Ann, where is Fleming now? Well, Katie, Fleming surrendered immediately. He was taken out of this courtroom with U.S. Marshals, a courtroom filled with 90 plus of his family and friends, as well as his victims. He's going to start serving that 46 month sentence right now. Now, of course, Fleming was the lawyer who worked with convicted killer Alec Murdoch, both in this scheme to steal $4.3 million from his late housekeeper, Gloria Satterfield's sons, as well as money taken from the family of a quadriplegic, Hakeem Pinckney. We heard from the Pinckney's lawyer today, Justin Bamberg. He said he believed Fleming showed great remorse for what he did, but only after his hand was forced. Lawyers don't need to steal their clients' money. And lawyers don't need to wait um, until the federal government comes knocking on their door to finally try and say they're sorry. Well, Judge Richard Gurgle recognized Fleming had pleaded guilty and had given money back that was stolen from the Satterfields while acting as their lawyer. However, the judge also said it was important to sentence, sending a strong message to other lawyers. Fleming also has to pay more than $100,000 in restitution to his victims. And coming up at 6, we will hear from the federal prosecutor, Emily Limehouse, in this case, and when we should be expecting Alec Murdoch to be coming to federal court as well. Reporting live from downtown tonight, I'm Ann Emerson. Back to you in the studio.